education in Iran is highly centralized. K-12 education is supervised by the Ministry of Education, and higher education is under the supervision of the Ministry of Science and Technology. The adult literacy rate in 2008 was 85.0% up from 36.5% in 1976. The requirement to enter into higher education is to have a high school diploma and pass the National University Entrance Examination, Iranian University Entrance Exam, known as Kinkor, which is the equivalent of the USSAT exams. Many students do a one-two-year course of pre-university, Bistainska which is the equivalent of GCE A-levels and International Baccalaureate. The completion of the pre-university course earns students the pre-university certificate. Iran is the only country in the Middle East with a high school course equivalent to the A-levels, SAT and International Baccalaureate. Higher education is sanctioned by different levels of diplomas. Kardani, Associate Degree, also known as Fauki Diplom, is delivered after two years of higher education. Karsanazi, bachelor's degree, also known as Likens, is delivered after four years of higher education, and Karsanazi Iarsat, master's degree, is delivered after two more years of study, after which another exam allows the candidate to pursue a doctoral program, PhD, known as Doctora. According to the Webometrics Ranking of World Universities, the top-ranking universities in the country are the University of Tehran, 468th worldwide, the Tehran University of Medical Sciences, 612th, and Ferdowsi University of Mashhad, 815th. Iran has increased its publication output nearly tenfold from 1996 through 2004, and has been ranked first in terms of output growth rate, followed by China. According to SCMAGO, Iran could rank fourth in the world in terms of research output by 2018, if the current trend persists. In 2009, ASUS Linux-based HPC system made by the Aerospace Research Institute of Iran Ari, was launched with 32 cores, and now runs 96 cores. Its performance was pegged at 192 GFLOPs. Sina 2 robot, which was designed by engineers at the University of Tehran, was unveiled in 2010. The Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers IEEE, has placed the name of Shurina among the five prominent robots of the world after analyzing its performance. In the biomedical sciences, Iran's Institute of Biochemistry and Biophysics is a UNESCO chair in biology. In late 2006, Iranian scientists successfully cloned a sheep by somatic cell nuclear transfer at the Royan Research Center in Tehran. According to a study by David Morrison and Ali Gaid M. Hossini, Harvard MIT and Cambridge, stem cell research in Iran is amongst the top 10 in the world. Iran ranks 15th in the world in nanotechnologies. Iran placed its domestically built satellite, amid into orbit on the 30th anniversary of the Iranian Revolution, on 2 February 2009, 204 through Safir rocket, becoming the ninth country in the world capable of both producing a satellite and sending it into space from a domestically made launcher. The Iranian nuclear program was launched in the 1950s. Iran is the seventh country to produce uranium hexafluoride, and controls the entire nuclear fuel cycle. Iranian scientists outside Iran have also made some major contributions to science. In 1960, Ali Javan co-invented the first gas laser and fuzzy set theory was introduced by Lotfi's aide. Iranian cardiologist, Tofi Musivand invented and developed the first artificial cardiac pump, the precursor of the artificial heart. Furthering research and treatment of diabetes, B1C was discovered by Samuel Rabba. Iranian physics is especially strong in string theory, with many papers being published in Iran. Iranian-American string theorist Cameron Vaffa proposed the Vaffa-Witten theorem together with Edward Witten. In August 2014, Maryam Mirzakhani became the first ever woman, as well as the first ever Iranian, to receive the Fields Medal, the highest prize in mathematics, 